What up, what up, everybody? <laughs> I normally don't even make YouTube videos anymore, but this is a subject that touched my heart because I was in a situation. You want to learn how to lower your child support? <laughs> and I'm going to tell you how to do it. In the state of Florida, I can't speak for every state, but the state of Florida... It is fairly easy. And there's a way to get totally off of child support, really. But I'm not going to touch on all of that in this video. But, alright. What you need to do to lower your child support. For you guys that actually be in your kid's life. You be picking up your kid, doing this, that, third for your kid. But you want child support. Like for no reason because you would already do it. But she put you on child support because she want to be uh, dirty. She want to be mad at you and all that kind of stuff. First step. You, and first of all, you don't need no lawyer. In family law, it's very easy to do these things yourself. You don't really need no lawyer. Um, 90% of the time. I was going to say 95, but I, I say 90% of the time. And I'll tell you later why I say 90% of the time. Because I was in a situation. Not even a bad situation. It was just... Anyways, I'll tell you later. So, first of all, you active father in your child's life. And you paying child support. That's probably outrageous when you're already in your child's life. Right? Here's what you do. In the state of Florida... You want to get joint custody. It's called a family plan. With the family plan, all you have to do is go up to your local courthouse, to your county courthouse, get the paperwork, tell them that you want to make a family plan. They're going to give you a big, giant packet. A lot of it is self-explanatory, but if you need help, you know, they may help. They'll help you a little bit. You know, if you need if you need help with it, contact me. I don't mind helping you, but it's very self-explanatory for you guys. Don't need no help. Um, um, you are established paternity. Just because you signed the birth certificate doesn't mean you the father. Father's a legal term or whatnot. This, you know, that just means you the dad. You know what I'm saying? That just when you sign a birth certificate, you just set yourself up for child support, basically. That's all that means. <laughs> but you ain't been labeled the father to you get a paternity test or um you claim paternity. So you gotta claim paternity. It's gonna cost you some money. I forgot how much it's gonna cost, but just paid a little bit of money. It's a couple I think it might be a couple hundred dollars. I don't remember. Oh, if you don't got the money, you can file intergent status. Intergent status, um, it won't cost you nothing, or it might cost you like five, ten dollars, some minute amount of money. So you get the packet, you fill it out. It's gonna ask you about income information and all that kind of stuff. Da 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 da. da. You know where you live, where you work, all that kind of stuff. Just fill it out, file it. What's gonna happen? You're gonna go to court. You're gonna have a mediation with your the mother of your kids and. Y'all will establish how you pick up the, you know, how you pick up the kids, when you get the kids, how many days out the year you get the kids, who gets the kids for this holiday, who's claiming taxes on the kids, for which years, you know, even in odd years, whichever is whatever is gonna be for you, and um, that's it. So after you do that, y'all go to court, you establish. Um, a parenting plan, that's what it's called in the state of Florida, which is like it's, it's like joint custody, it's called in other states or whatever. And you get that. Then you file a motion to modify your child support. You file a motion to modify your child support. And they're going to look at how many times out the year you get your child. And calculate it, and it's gonna lower your child support significantly, right? For me, 
Um, I was paying eight fifty a month for my son. After I did that, my 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 payments are hundred dollars a month. It's nothing. And and actually, I think no no not that I think. And actually, I could be totally off of child support, but it's such a low amount. I don't really care. Then two, um, I do want her to be able to get like food stamps or ELC, you know, some government programming because you can't get government uh, assistance without the child support, I believe. But anyways, I want her to get that. She's not currently using none of that right now. I don't know why, but she's stupid. But eight fifty to a hundred dollars. That's nothing. And for most of you guys that are paying, uh, you know, four hundred, three hundred. If you're paying two hundred dollars a month, you really don't got nothing to complain about. But still, but if you're in your kid's life and you're doing things for them, you want to lower your child support. Just get. A family plan in the state of Florida, which is joint custody and a lower your child support because I know when you get them, you're still buying them stuff. You're still doing stuff with them and on top of what you're giving their mother, which you don't know how that money being spent. You know, my baby mom is irresponsible with money, you know. Um, she, does, she doesn't live on her own. She lives with her parents. And I would say thankfully. But she's irresponsible with money. She does, you know. I never was the dude to be a deadbeat at all. But she was mad at me at one point in time. She was mad at me. I don't even understand why. But whatever. But um, that's it. That's all you gotta do. Go to the courthouse. The simple forms you fill out. Don't pay a lawyer two, three, four, five grand just to do some simple paperwork you could do yourself. You know, as long as you ain't no criminal and no threat to your kids, you gonna get the you gonna get the custody. You know what I'm saying? And then you gotta go file separately to modify your child support because they are two different cases. They're not all in the same, they don't intertwine. They kinda do, but they don't. Two different types of cases. So um if you feel this, give me a thumbs up, give me a like, subscribe. I'm gonna be posting more videos like this to help you guys out. Um, especially in the state of Florida, I don't know all the laws and legalities in other states, but technically, you got joint custody in another state, um, your child, and, and then you redo your your child support. It's gonna get low, so that's all I gotta say. Thank you for watching, and um, have a good day, have a good night, afternoon, whenever you're watching this. Got any questions? Hit me up. I'll help you anytime. I got time. <laughs> anytime I got, I'm normally pretty busy, but anytime I got time, I help you out.